All right, today I'm going to be reviewing this uh, Big Daddy Rosie from Baojot 2. Here's the front of the box, the side, the back. That's where I can't see because of the glare. And here's the other side, the picture. And let me see a close up. All right, here's the little bio for the Big Daddy Rosie. If you want to read it, pause it. Here we have a picture of <coughs> Big Daddy Rosie and the two little sisters, Bouncer, Delta, Rosie, Splicer, Big Sister, and the repaint Elite Bouncer, which I will not get because basically it's the same thing as the regular Bouncer, it's just a different color and <coughs> they changed the drill a little bit and that's about it. So. Alright, here he is. When you get him out of the box, basically you have to figure it's a weapon and it's a air tank, whatever this thing is, that goes on to his back. And here he is, the figure. There's the front. There's the side. Here's the back without the canister. And here's the other side. Alright, let's put this on and uh, show you what it looks like with the backpack on. Alright, here he is with the canister on. Actually looks really good with it on. And uh, this is the best I could get him to hold his weapon. Uh, can't do anything else with it. Because uh, he's just so bulky. And then uh, he's got this canister right by his waist, so it's blocking some movement and then uh, these uh, little clamps thingy on his uh, wrist uh, on his arm there uh, blocking as well too so this is the best I could get him to hold his weapon and uh, let's get a good look at the detailing on him see the portholes nice and done Color wise, this one looks. Um, I like this coloring better than the Bouncer or the Delta. I don't know, I just like the color a little bit better. <clears throat> and here's the tank in the back. There's a little ventilation system going on, I think. Overall, this figure is really good, but uh, I don't know if it's really worth 20 bucks. I mean, this figure, the size-wise, is it's almost as big as the uh, Bouncer, but not really. <clears throat> it's like in between the Bouncer and the Delta. So, 20 bucks, mm, I guess it's worth it, but I don't know. Uh, shoes knee pads mm -hmm. and uh, articulation wise head nothing shoulders uh, yeah I could bend out but uh, it's restricted by this uh, strap here this rubber strap and, uh, <clears throat> wrist they bend and rotate see how the joint is and then uh, wrist they actually Rotate and also bend. Uh, that's good. Uh, nose, uh, no waist articulation. But they do have um, thighs. I mean, uh, yeah, hips. Uh, yeah, it's it rotates, but doesn't do that much. And then uh, knees, they bend. And the ankles, they pivot slightly. <coughs> so overall. Articulation wise, well you don't expect a whole lot of articulation because if you already have the, the bouncer you know how articulated he is and then uh, this is basically the same thing but uh, yeah this I, yeah actually I like this better than bouncer or the delta so I guess it is worth 20 bucks this weapon some more it does have that rusted look that's kind of cool. Mm. 
Let me get closer. Alright. Is that a happy? No, that's not a happy face. I thought it was a happy face painted on him or something. But nope. Mm -hmm. Just want to show you guys the detailing on this figure. A lot of copper paint, a lot of silver paint, and weathering. It looks really good on him. They did a really good job on the weathering. Yeah, it's a great figure, I have to say. Oh, and uh, his, uh, his arm, uh, his, uh, his uh, right arm, it will be really hard for you to, for him to grab hold of this uh, weapon here. So what I did was uh, I used a hair dryer <clears throat> to soften up the plastic. It'll, it'll make your life a whole lot easier. face all right let's do a comparison and it looks like he's definitely taller than everyone else uh, as you can see here just a tad bit taller but the uh, bouncer is hunchbacked so that's why but yeah I like I uh, yeah I do like um, <coughs> um, this um, Rosie a lot more than these two so yeah, if you if you see them, definitely get them. And uh, Toys R Us, I just got them today. And uh, I went to two Toys R Us, and only one of them has a has them. So um, him, her, I'm not sure. So yeah, so definitely pick them up if you see this figure. And mm, yep, there you go. Thanks for watching.